we're gonna experiment with a different Play-Doh recipe. Normally, I use one and it gets a little bit crumbly. So I have a recipe for something called soft dough that we're gonna try today. So here's the recipe. Two cups of cornstarch, one cup conditioner, combine the ingredients, mix, and then play. So this is what I got. Some cornstarch, some conditioner that smells really good, and materials that you'll need are a mixing bowl, a mixing spoon, and a measuring cup. Preferably a one cup measuring cup because we are going to be measuring cups for this um, project. All right, so let's start with the first step. Two cups of cornstarch. Whoops. One cup, pour it into our mixing bowl. and two cups. We'll pour it into our mixing bowl. All right, and next we need one cup of conditioner. And we'll pour that into our mixing bowl. All right. Then it says to mix and play. There was a little note in the recipe that I found online that we should add more conditioner if it seems crumbly once we start mixing. So we'll see how it goes and add more conditioner if we need it. So it's already starting to stick together in the bowl. That's a really good sign. It's sticking together pretty nicely. So now I'm starting to kind of press it a little bit with my spoon. I'm gonna take it out and show you what it looks like so far. So, so far I have a ball like this. So I'm gonna use my hands now and see if I can knead it a little bit inside the bowl and get it to be a doughy consistency, so it's not so sticky. Okay. Well, it's sticking a little bit to my hand, so that's something to note. Um, you know, children, some don't like stuff sticking to their hands, so they might not like this dough. But I'm wondering if you could just use a little bit more cornstarch to help with the sticking. So maybe I'll pour some in the bowl and just a little sprinkle. And roll the dough in it a little bit so it's not so sticky. All right, well, this definitely feels a lot softer than normal Play-Doh. And it's a lot easier to work with. But my question is, is it going to work the same as regular Play-Doh with cookie cutters? So I'm just gonna try a cookie cutter while I have you here and press it into the dough. I'm gonna roll this out a little bit and lay a cookie cutter on there. Let's see. 
Hmm. So it worked, but the dough is kind of sticky and the piece doesn't really come out as good as a normal um, piece would with a cookie cutter, but it's really fun, really soft. I might use something like this maybe um, if I was having the kids practice rolling dough into um, different shapes or if I was working with younger children that are like three and their hands aren't as strong yet. So I hope you enjoyed this. Try it at home.